Concussions are a hot topic these days as coaches, parents and researchers try to figure out how to keep kids safe while playing contact sports. But what if your child has experienced a serious concussion? What can you do? V. Cooper has one family story. I was feeling dizzy and tired and I couldn't, I didn't have my balance straight and I just felt sick. Sydney Green was in grade 10 playing in a weekend soccer tournament. She headed a drop kick ball and suffered a concussion but she didn't recognize the symptoms and thought, I'll just go to bed, I'll sleep it off, I'll take a gravel, I'll play the next day. That second day changed her life. I went up for a header and another girl was going up for the same header and we just connect heads and then that was, that was it. The impact to Sydney's brain greatly disrupted her electrical activity. She was trying so hard to study for for exams because it was around exam time and it was just like it was it was impossible like she couldn't even keep her eyes open it affected my mood and my happiness and I just felt depressed she would lie down and close her eyes and I was reading to her and she was like trying to absorb the information and no one could really understand what was going on and I couldn't either they just thought I was going through a phase a friend recommended Valentis clinics I was honestly very skeptical about it how like a treatment like that could reverse the symptoms of a concussion. The treatment, advanced neurofeedback, realigns the brain's electrical circuitry because the concussion has knocked it off balance. And after 20 sessions over a four month period, Sydney's brain rebalanced. It has been amazing for her. It has been life altering. My grades have skyrocketed. Like I'm going to the university of my choice, like which I'm super excited about. And like I'm back to my old normal self, like happy, like able to sleep now, not anxious, like just like feeling like a normal human being again, which I thought was impossible to be honest.